Hey, what's going on YouTube? Cody Orgel here, coming to you guys with another video. And uh, just got out of savers, and you could pretty much say I freaking killed it. I brought my camera along just in case I did kill it, so I can show you guys straight after I got out of there. But I got out of that savers, and I scored some really nice stuff right here beside me. Alright, so let's get into it. So number one item I picked up was a really nice Tommy Bahama extra extra large 100% silk button front Hawaiian like floral design shirt with the awesome wooden buttons right there. Something like this. Um, I actually paid $10 for this. I didn't get any discounts today unfortunately. But still, considering this is a really big size, it could sell for some really good money. I sold one in the past. I think it was an extra large or maybe a large and I sold that one for about 35 bucks. So for this one, I'm going to go for about $40 to $50 on that one right there. Next item was a Versace polo shirt. It's got the Versace, Versace, Versace going on. This is the V2 Classic Size Medium. And I only paid $3 for this shirt right here. It's got really crazy buttons on it. I reckon I could get around $30 or so for this one. Next little score was a SMS Santani uh, Italian cycling jersey in a extra small... They had $6 on this one, and this is about a $25 to a $30 jersey. This is more of a modern jersey. It feels quite quality. Um, it's got that silky smooth kind of texture to it, and it's got the SMS Santeni logo on the back there. This is a score right here. This is an Australian Olympics Sydney 2000, uh, kind of like a windbreaker winter jacket. This is something that the officials wore um, when they were in the Olympics in 2000. This is a Bonds size large. Paid $15 for this, but this thing's a jackpot. It ranges from about $50 all the way up to about $250. I'm not sure why there's such a big difference, but I've got to do a bit more research. Um, and if I find out before I upload this video, I will um, include how much I am going to list it for um, in the edited video. But also on the sleeve, it's got Sydney 2000 Bonds. It's just an amazing score. Um, it's got really cool colors going on at the back there. Um, so this is an awesome jacket. So I'm not sure who it was that said I don't sell Australian stuff, but here we go. Here's an Australian item that I'm gonna be selling. So the next score was the sick pair of Air Jordans. These are uh, number two uh, retro QF um, university blue style ones. These are six shoes. I paid $15 for these. So just Google the number that sits underneath the sizing and above the barcode there. And search that in Google and it'll tell you if they're authentic or not. So these are authentic Jordans, 15 bucks. So as you can see here, I looked up on Google and I got some information about them. And uh, these are authentic. And also I should mention, um, when I go to the eBay sold listings, these are unsold. But if I go to the eBay sold listings, I'll show you how much they sold for. Go to sold listings and in a use condition. And if we scroll through, a pair had sold. These sold, and keep in mind this is Australian dollars, for about $188. And these are also a size 13, so they're a bigger size than these. These are a size uh, 9.5 US. So they sold for $140 US dollars. Um, I'm probably going to get mine for about 100. I'm going to put them up for about um, 100 US dollars, around 120 Australian or so, and uh, see how they go. All right, then the last two items I picked up were a pair of hiking bags. Now, these were actually just rolled out onto the showroom floor as soon as I was about to leave, and I had one more look, and um, the guy just put these out. So the brand is Katmandu. All I did was in the searches for eBay, I looked up Katmandu and a keyword here, glue on. I saw that some of them were selling for around $60 to $90 a bag. I paid $20 for each bag, $40 for both bags. Um, and I'll probably be able to flip them both. I'll probably sell them together or I might sell them separately. I haven't decided yet. This one is a little bit smaller than this one. So I might price this at around 90, this one at about 60 70 and uh we'll get them sold but thanks for watching the video guys i really appreciate you guys watching um i say this like every time but i truly do appreciate every one of you watching my videos so if you have not already hit that subscribe button give it a good thumbs up comment down below and i'll see you in the next one